words in Kiefer's mouth. I mean, he's trying to help us here, right? You, you love Christina. I do love her. I don't want anything bad to happen or that. This whole thing was just a big misunderstanding, right? Yeah. What are you doing? Why are you cutting this guy so much slack? <laughs> I mean, there's so much motive here I could drown in. Christina lied to him. She put on a dress that he bought for her, went after another guy, made him look like a complete idiot. You excited about Harvard, Kiefer? It's not fun to be made a fool of, is it? And that's why you did it. That's why you beat her. Because you think she deserved it. take the SAT prep class if you want. I mean, you did really well on the practice test. It just depends, I think, honey, what college you want to go to. You might need your numbers to be higher. I don't know. Mm -hmm. If I get accepted to Middlebury or Georgetown, I at least want to consider them. Sure. Whatever you decide, okay? Question, how do you feel about taking a, a self-defense class? Would that be okay? Um... Dante was saying that with domestic violence, which is kind of was, <clears throat> the guy usually does it again. Statistically, that's true. Dante seemed kind of worried. He even asked me to meet him at Kelly's. He had a ton of questions. It's probably helping Lucky. Helping him with what? Honey, I probably should have mentioned this to you before, but they are going to continue investigating what happened the other night. But the charges against Ethan have been dropped. You promised we'd let this go. It's not that simple, really. I, I can't believe you lied to me. I, don't see I told all the guys about Christina. You know, how she's, how she's smart and, and beautiful, and you wouldn't even know her father's a criminal. <laughs> I love Christina. I wanted them to see why. Instead, she just made me look like an idiot. Oh, man, I, I can't even imagine what that'd be like, hanging out at that party after she stood you up like that. Yeah, well, I, I was the only guy without a date, so, yeah. So you left the party early, went to her house, and beat the crap out of her. Okay, that is, that is not what happened at all. I stayed at the party for a while. When did you leave? It was, it was at least 11, maybe later. I, I don't know for sure. Where'd you go? How could I be so stupid? I just wanted to talk to her. Look, Kiefer, no one's blaming you for anything here. This is, you got a raw deal, man. <laughs> I just wanted to ask her why. I mean, I thought you canceled because you were mad at me. Why would I be mad at you? How should I know? But you beat her up instead, didn't you? No, no. No, you're hurting me! <laughs> what? All right, all right, take it easy. Why don't you just tell us what, what really happened? I got there pretty late. Molly answered the door and said Kay was in the hospital. You're lying. You'd been there earlier. Now, why would he go back to the house if he'd already beaten Christina up? I, I wanted... You were, you were afraid that you'd killed her, weren't you? It isn't like that. Everybody knows that Ethan didn't do it, okay? It's just a matter of time. The truth is going to come out, man. Christina is going to crack, and when she does, Harvard is not going to protect you from the reach of Sonny Corinthos. But a jail cell night, if you want a future, you better confess. I keep telling you that I want this to be over, and you promised me it would, and now you have Lucky Spencer investigating? Honey, first of all, I didn't lie to you. I didn't say anything because I, you don't need anything else to be upset about. You keep saying that you want us to have this honest relationship, but you only tell me what you want me to hear. I'm doing the best. Really, I am. I really wish Dante would have talked to me before he decided to question you. Dante's my brother. Why can't he just believe me? Honey, I'm sure he does believe you. The same as Luke believes what Ethan is saying is the truth. And, and, and Luke has the right to, to want his questions resolved. What kind of questions? The same kind of questions the police would ask if this were a trial. What will happen when they prove Ethan did it? Hopefully, I wanted to leave town because it would just be easier on everyone. But right now, we've we've all agreed to let Luke and Dante pursue this. Even Dad. Even Dad. Why am I the only one that didn't know about the investigation? We all just want to help you get past this. That's all. You have been traumatized, 
and you need time to 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 be supported and to heal and it might help you do that if lucky and dante can can verify that you told the truth okay i'm not gonna admit to anything i didn't do was that the first time you'd hit her we've been beating her for a while now i didn't maybe you lost your temper got carried away i mean if you did do it and i'm not saying you did but if you did maybe this is a good time to uh, tell your side of the story wait a minute you guys are working together aren't you I cannot believe I fell for this. Hey, Kiefer. I shouldn't need to tell you this, but you stay the hell away from my sister, at least until this whole mess is cleared up. Yeah, go to hell. All right. Well, he was just about the same man. You did it. Son of a bitch beat Christina. And she blamed Ethan to try to protect him. That's why she was so scared. What, you mean of Kiefer? No. Scared of what her father might do. Well, it makes sense, in a way, you know. Blame the wrong guy, then get the charges dropped. I don't hope the whole thing just goes away. You know, we're still pretty short on evidence, but we definitely scared him. He's gonna start scrambling to try to cover his tracks, and that's when he's gonna make a mistake. Give us what we need to charge him. Yeah, you know, we gotta keep the pressure on this guy. Because there's no way I'm letting that spoiled little punk get away with beating up my sister. Christina's brother, the cop and another cop, the one who took her statements, stopped me at Kelly's, and they started asking just a, a, a bunch of questions about Christina, and they think I'm the one who hit her. What do I do? And I were already dragged down to the police station once to deal with this. I didn't realize I was a suspect. You, you should have never gotten involved with that girl to begin with. Your mother and I both tried to warn you. Her father is a menace to society, and Christina is clearly unstable. I don't know what to do. If you're going to make it at Harvard, you're going to have to start thinking on your own two feet. I'm okay, trying. buddy boy? I'm trying. I'm trying. Christina got the charges dropped against her attack. Now you're worried about being a suspect. So what are you going to do? Think. What can you do? Convince Christina to reinstate the charges. There you go. I'm sure you, you can convince her. No, no. Her brother warned me to stay away from her. So what? Are you going to allow yourself to be bullied by some small-town policeman? Talk to Christina, okay? Get her to reinstate the charges, and then forget about this nonsense and get on with your life. Okay. Is Ethan around? No, I sent him on a mission to annoy the quarterman. Did you find something else? I think so. Let's try to get a clear timeline. So you're not here to arrest your brother? No. I'm getting close to solving this thing, though. I want to get it right. For Ethan as well as everyone else involved. Hello? Hey. Hey, I'm glad you answered. How are you feeling? Better. Don't worry. It's all working out. Well, how's the trial going? Terrible. How terrible? Dad lost it in the courtroom. I saw the whole thing. He was screaming that Claudia was a witch and that she got what she deserved. Dad didn't kill Claudia, I did. Dad would have killed Claudia eventually. Because of what she did to me. It's not your fault. You were just at the wrong place at the wrong time. And even if you hadn't gotten shot, Dad would have found some excuse to kill Claudia anyway because he hated her. And she wasn't afraid to stand up to him. So in a way, even if Dad didn't swing that axe handle, our father is still guilty. 